to my channel in today's video I'm gonna show you guys my new skincare routine specifically my night routine I'm going to show you the products that I've been using that have helped my skin go from here to here so if you guys want to see what products I'm using on my new routine for my skin just keep on watching okay so before I go ahead and take off my makeup I want to talk a little bit about the products that I've been using for my skin if you guys have been following my channel you know I struggle with my face with my skin I have oily skin hyperpigmentation blackheads breakouts you name it everything that makes you feel self-conscious when you take your makeup off I had or oh, and I slightly still do have if you guys hear that background noise please ignore it apparently in DC it's a tradition after the 4th of July people still have their fireworks going off for two weeks after the 4th so just please ignore that anyways so I'm gonna show you the products that I've been using now I'm gonna put in the description down below all the videos of when I talked about different face products that I've used throughout the years that just ruined my face and you see where I've gone, where I've come from to where I'm at right now. So the products that I've been using are from this brand called Ole Henriksen. And I have done a video before where I slightly talked about some of the products that I have been using from this brand. And I'm just going to show you everything that I've been using. My skin has improved tremendously and I'm just so glad because now I can feel some more confidence when I take my makeup off. You know, I don't have to stress so much about blackheads and breakouts and hyperpigmentation. So my face is doing amazing. In addition to using Ole Henriksen, I've also been using this Kiehl's face mask. This is a turmeric and cranberry seed mask that is incredibly amazing. It is so gentle on the skin, especially if you have oily and sensitive skin this mask is the bomb it has turmeric which is a natural skin lightener so that's why i use this mask a lot every week i use it it just it just does amazing things to my skin it helps lighten my blackheads which good stuff in addition to using that mask i also use scent ives blackhead control mask so this is the blackhead clearing green tea and bamboo scrub I say mask this is a scrub um, I use this scrub I used to use this scrub every day until I stopped using it every day and now I just use it on the days when I dip cleanse rather than using this every day I'm gonna show you what I'm using every day I really enjoy using this scrub because its exfoliation factor is medium so it's not too strong and it's not too low it's just very moderate and it just that's perfect for someone that has very sensitive skin and wants to scrub every day to kind of help with um, lightening those blackheads and just exfoliating and clearing out your pores this is a perfect a perfect scrub to use every day i used to use it every day and i had no problems but i wanted to kind of reserve it and not use it every day because i didn't want to run out so i stopped using it every day and i just use it once a week now I just mentioned that I stopped using it every day and I substituted it with something else. So what I substituted it with is this spa brush and I think I've talked about this before on my channel. I use this to wash my face and clean my face every day. I use this brush with my cleanser every day to just clean off the dirt, makeup, everything else that's on my skin. So that's that. Now this is the Ola Henriksen face cleanser that I use every day. This cleanser is so good. It is under the green collection. So Ola Henriksen has different collections. They have a green collection, a blue collection, and an orange collection. This cleanser though, it helps when you have very sensitive and oily skin. It has, it feels very gentle on the skin. It doesn't have harsh active ingredients, which is nice so this is called the find your balance oil control cleanser so it definitely helps balance all your oils and it helps your skin not look oily every time next product that i use is the toner i use this toner every day during the day and this is as you can see from the green line and this is the balancing force oil control toner again this is an oil balancing product that i use which helps control all my oils um the next product i use is a toner as well so this toner i use it at night so this is specifically 
used at night you don't want to use it during the day because it's very strong and it exposes your skin to the sun this is the glow 2 oh dark spot toner and i yeah that's why i actually got it because it helps with dark spots so i love it I, I love how it makes my skin feel if you have very sensitive skin i would use this product every other night because it has alpha hydroxy acid which increases the skin's exposure to the sun so you don't want to use this every day if if you use if you use it for the first time on your skin you feel like your skin is burning and it's just agitated i will just use it every other day and once you use this you want to put on a lot of moisturizer so i use this at night surprisingly i never got those reactions that they were talking about my skin burning my skin feeling like i needed to put in put on a lot of moisturizer i just feel normal when i use it so it's a good product next product that i use is the truth serum and i use this every day day and night this is the magic product from the ola henriksen orange collection it just brightens your skin it really is true to its name it helps boost your collagen levels it just makes my skin look so bright and vibrant it makes it look so youthful i use this every day it's a little bit on the expensive side this bottle is 50 dollars, and this is the smallest bottle and they have a regular bottle which is like, i think 75 or 85 dollars so this is very expensive but it really is worth it for your skin and a little goes a long way so i guess it's worth the purchase it really for me i would say it was worth the purchase because it just it's helped my skin a lot the last product that i use from all henriksen is the moisturizer this is the sheer transformation perfecting moisturizer and it's extremely gentle on their skin i mean if you have sensitive oily skin this right here is the real deal i mean it just it's so soft it's very gentle it's not too harsh it almost feels like you don't have anything on i use it day and night i haven't got a night cream and this doesn't say that you have to use it oh yeah it's an am and, and pm face moisturizer i guess that's why i got it because you can use it at night and a, during the day it's always a plus when you get a product that can be used like a dual product that you can use at night and during the day because you don't have to buy two different products to do the same job like how i got two toners i mean it's fine these are gonna go for months but you know I've rumbled enough so let's just get right into what i'm gonna do with my skin also one thing that i need to mention i'm gonna review using a face steamer it's gonna be my first time using a face steamer i've never used one it's gonna be my first time doing it here on the channel so we'll see how my skin feels after i do it i'm telling you guys i've been trying out different ways to get my skin popping and looking hot girl summer so yeah let's get to it i'm going to start off by taking my makeup off I'm using the Neutrogena wipes. You guys know these, right? Love them. I'm just going to take it off really quickly. Okay, so my makeup is off. So now what I'm going to do is I am going to go in with the St. Ives scrub that I use to scrub and I'm going to apply it across my face like that I'm just gonna use both hands to just go in only reason I have been breaking out is because of wearing masks prior to wearing masks I wasn't breaking out ever since I started using this product but because I wear masks every day, it just, I don't know, all that dirt just accumulating in the mask just affects my face. Okay, so I'm done with this. Now I'm going to go ahead and wash it out and then I will be right back. So I'm done washing my face and taking off the scrub. Now I'm going to go ahead and use my face cleanser. When I use my face cleanser, I actually use this spa brush. Now, I've talked about these spa brushes in the past in one of my videos, so you guys can go look at that. But I just put my moisture, my face cleanser on this brush, 
put some water and then I just use it in circular motions. I use this particular head every time I dip cleanse because it just gives me a deeper exfoliation and that's what you're supposed to do on your dip cleansing day. So I'm gonna put the cleanser on top of this, like this, if you guys can see. And you can always increase the speed if you want. Kind of like that. Now I'm going to go ahead and wash my face and I will come back. So now I'm going to go ahead and apply the mask, the turmeric mask that I showed you guys earlier. Every time I apply my mask, I like to use a flat brush, a flat makeup brush. It's just easy for applying and it just makes it, I don't know, it's just more efficient. It helps me just do it nicely, I guess. I'm just gonna apply that. Now I like to go over my eyebrows because I break out sometimes underneath my brow bone. So I'm just gonna go over my eyebrows. So I have the schema going, so I'm gonna put it close to my face and then I'm gonna steam my face for about eight to 10 minutes. So I'm gonna get a timer and just put it on. And I'm just gonna hold it here for eight minutes. Feels really good. Okay, one thing I forgot to mention is you are only supposed to put in 50 milliliters of water into this steamer and it's supposed to either be distilled water or purified water because regular tap water affects the durability of the steamer, odd. But it also says that that 50 milliliters of water lasts you eight to 10 minutes. So I just steamed my face for eight to 10 minutes. If you don't have a timer to time yourself, just turn it on and it will last you that long because that's how long the water lasts. And now I have a fresh face on. I am going to go ahead and apply the toner. This is the night toner that I told you guys about that I use every night. And I'm just gonna go ahead and apply that with a cotton but. Do you guys see the difference in my skin? My skin feels so good. That steamer really makes a difference. I mean, it just opens up everything, everything. Now I'm going to go ahead and apply the serum a little bit, just that much. And I'm just gonna apply it everywhere in my face. And finally, I applied the moisturizer. This is it, guys. This is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I like to follow these steps every Sunday to just dip cleanse and make sure that my skin is being taken care of. I never used to have a skincare routine, kind of like something structured. I never used to have that. I just used to do whatever. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for stopping by. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and leave some comments below and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you. Bye. Cause nothing really matters when you see it from a